friends, happy 2023! In this video, I will be speaking in English because I want to keep practicing. You have seen many of my videos in Spanish, but I will keep practicing English. So, uh, I have a few things to tell you. For example, if you saw my last video about December blog, you saw that I was going to have a cat. Well, not yet, but probably soon. And also, another thing is that, are you looking at my new studio? This is a temporary studio, probably for one month or a little bit more. So let's see what I'm going to create here. Yes, the month has been super crazy. Well, not the month, but the 10 days and counting. So I have been doing a lot of plectrums or guitar picks. I'm working a lot with my brand Tesoro and also I have been painting a lot of natal charts and I will I will show you too because I have shipped already many ones are very pretty and I will put it on frames and this is where I start my video of January And now they have the frames and they look so pretty. And also I started to record some bowling or humming and I made a song. And yes, at the beginning all sounds strange and funny, but once it's blended with the music, Everything changed. This time I recorded several voices to put it as one. And this is the first print of the year ready to go. And now painting two natal charts for babies. And this month we have started a ping pong. I have received this watercolor from another artist and I'm going to be painting on it. Then I will return this to her and she will return the one that I sent. And we are going to be switching works. Let's see how it, everything ends. So far this is what I have done. And nothing better to start the year with an exhibition. This is my first solo in Mandala Group. We had our old paintings on the San Luis Artist Guild. We have been painting this canvas during probably one or almost two years. And finally our canvas were displayed in this gallery. Also we were making live art. Probably you remember 
some videos or pictures where I was working on these canvases. It really was so fun to do live art. You can see here Mary Beth, she was painting a canvas and here is me painting another one and we were switching between canvases in different times. Here is Gray, Maria and me. So everything is about to put color and I'm here with Nancy, we are painting with red and green and as you can see, we work a lot of botanical theme. Everything happens organically. We don't have a sketch or some ideas. We just arrive and paint whatever we want. And at the end, we can have an amazing result. Also, I have asked the people to paint with us. I give them a brush and I ask for their favorite colors and they were applying something on the canvas too. It really is amazing to jump from one canvas to another and try to keep uh, the composition and just keep adding the elements to keep a balance and the colors and dimensions and shapes and at the end you can have something amazing and you can see people here putting some brush strokes and everything goes along so well Here I am again singing and composing a song to celebrate in Bolic. Actually this bowling was from last year but I never used it till now. And now they sound like this when I put the voice and the music together.
all my music videos you can find them in my music channel i will let the link on the information about this video and we have started a new painting for our workshop this painting belongs to the artist Gabriel Alvix and this will be so colorful. We are working with acrylics and I will be showing you the process and probably I will do a video about this artist and his work. Also I have started to work with a sketch for a personal project and I will be doing a video about this painting. Also, I made a video about a Mexican-American artist. Her name was Rosa Rolanda, and you can find the link about this video in the information of my video. De su inspiración y de las cosas más sobresalientes que hizo durante su vida. No se pierdan toda la información de este video. And yes, more about the link. I was singing in the parking lot and it was super cold but I wanted to do something to celebrate the new moon. And this is how it sounds with music. I am recording part of my process or it's not probably a part but a whole process since how the idea was born, why the colors, why those elements, what is the meaning and I will be explaining everything about my painting. Para empezar a delinear mi sketch me encanta pues empezar con los charpies. And finally, some time out, I went to the Kempter Museum and this is my first time going out to a place since 2023. <laughs> I spent a lot of time in my studio, but I'm glad that I visit this museum. It was my first time here and it was an amazing exhibition of different artists and different styles. And here you can see a dog, a colorful dog that I'm painting for a workshop with acrylics. And also I have been painting again with my other painting for another workshop. regreso otra vez al retrato y bueno no me he arreglado pero ya me bañé <risa> eh, tengo mi té listo y ahora sí a empezar el domingo pero eh, no sé si quiero poner tintas o no no siempre pongo las tintas eso es a veces como just for fun ay no sé no sé si le voy a poner o no pues saben que sí les voy a poner las tintas porque quiero hacer como unas capas tridimensionales
tinta ya está hecho, ya tiene todas las capas en tinta. Qué bueno que lo hice, porque la verdad sí es como satisfacción. Sí es como satisfactorio eh, mientras vas pintando ver el proceso del cambio, ¿no? Entonces, así es como ya va las capas en tinta. Y bueno, sobre esto voy a aplicar el óleo. Aparte, una de las cosas, aparte una de las cosas que me gusta hacer es, bueno, no hacer, automáticamente sucede, son estos drippings de al estar trabajando con, con la tinta como todo se va chorreando y bueno me parece que es algo muy padre es al final un efecto que muchos drippings se cubren con el óleo pero eh, los que están ahí algunos sí los voy a dejar ok hoy sí voy a trabajar con los ojos es por donde empiezo siempre casi siempre los portraits y avanzar todo lo que pueda de la cara And I was so happy my illustration of Mother Earth was sold and also another original illustration this is a fox that I made for a wall calendar and I'm so happy they are going to another home I have included a print as a gift and also this print is ready to go I made an embellishment with sparkling glitter as you can see for the rainbow effect looks so pretty and January is almost over as you can see the days has been very cold very grey sometimes but let's see what happens in February <laughs> 